dear students in this video you are going to learn about decimal expansion of real numbers that is decimal expansion of rational numbers and irrational numbers you are very familiar with rational numbers so let us start with decimal expansion of rational numbers find the decimal expansion of 2 by 3 let us divide 2 by 3 here 2 is the divisor 3 is the dividend since we are finding decimal expansion put the decimal point and after the decimal point you can put as many zeros you want because 2.000 is it is is equal to 2 3000 zero subtract 2 minus 0 is 2 So next, take the next digit. That is zero. This digit is after the decimal point, so you have to put the decimal point at quotient. So three six are eighteen. Again, subtract. Twenty minus eighteen is. Two. Take the next digit. That is zero. Again, three six are eighteen. Observe, we are getting same remainder again and again. in the previous step also we got 2 as the remainder in this step also we got 2 as the remainder so we can stop here because if you continue you will get the same remainder so 2 by 3 is equal to 0.6666 here 6 is repeating so instead of writing 6 so many times put bar over 6 that is 0.6 bar means 6 is repeating let us go for next one here we have to divide 5 by 8 put the decimal point and zeros after the decimal point here 5 is lesser than 8 so 8 zeros are zero then subtract 5 minus 0 is 5 take the next digit that is after the decimal point so put decimal point in the quotient 86048 that is if you subtract you will get 2 take the next digit Two zero sixteen. We cannot stop here because we are getting different remainders. So we have to continue. Take the next digit.
we have to proceed till the remainders are repeating or the remainder we get 0 so 5 by 8 is equal to 0 0.625 In this case, we got 0 as the remainder. Let us do next one. That is 11 divided by 6. divide 11 by 6 put the decimal point and zeros after the decimal point this will be easiest for you to take the digits after subtraction 6 1 0 6 if you subtract you will get 5 then take the next digit that is after the decimal point put decimal point in the quotient 6 8 0 48 subtract That is 2. Take the next digit. That is 0. So 6 3s are 18. Again, 20 minus 8 is, 18 is 2. See here, Re remainder is repeating. So, you can stop here. Or you can do one more step. So, again, we got 2 as the remainder. See the quotient. Here 3 is repeating block of digit. So 11 by 6 is equal to 1.83333. It goes on. It's never ending. So here 3 is repeating. So put bar over 3. 1.83 bar. Do next one that is 13 divided by 4 divide now Four threes are twelve. Subtract that is one. Take the next digit. So four two are eight. Ten minus eight is two. Take the next digit that is zero. So it will become twenty four.
फोर फाइव जर ट्वेंटी हियर वी आर गेटिंग जीरो एज द रिमेंडर सो थर्टीन बाय फोर इज इक्वल टू थ्री पॉइंट टू फाइव Let us summarize these decimal expansions. See, in some cases, we got zero as the remainder. If we are not getting zero as the remainder, then the remainders are repeating. So, in the quotient, we get. repeating block of digits so if the decimal expansion terminates or ends after a finite number of steps such decimal expansions are called terminating decimal expansions these are the cases where we got zero as the remainder if we are getting zero as the remainder then those decimal expansions are called terminating decimal expansions let us write few examples for terminating decimal expansions look at the solved decimal expansions That is five by eight is equal to zero point six two five. And one one more thirteen by four. That is three point. Two five, and one more example. That is five by eight, which is equal to zero point six two five, where we got remainder zero. Zero point six two five. We can write few more. One by two is the terminating decimal expansion. to write terminating decimal expansions denominator of the rational numbers should contain prime factors of only 2 and 5 if the prime factorization of the denominator of rational number contains only 2 and 5 then it is terminating decimal expansion look at the non terminating decimal expansions if it is non terminating then block of digits are repeating so if the decimal expansion never terminates but have a repeating block of digits such decimal expansions are called non terminating recurring decimal expansions Two by three is equal to zero point six bar. Eleven by six is equal to one point eight three bar. These are non-terminating recurring decimal expansions.
write few more, four more example 1 by 9 2 by 11 5 by 13 in non terminating recurring decimal expansions the prime factorization of the denominator contains numbers other than 2 and 5 so these are called non terminating recurring decimal expansions so decimal expansion of rational numbers is either terminating or non terminating recurring so what about the decimal expansion of irrational numbers decimal expansion of irrational numbers is non terminating and non recurring look at the examples value of root 2 value of root 3 value of root 5 these are all non terminating non recurring decimal expansions because here block of digits are not repeating we can write few more see here 0 0.10 100 0 1000 like this here block of digits are not repeating it's different A particular block is not repeating. Such decimal expansions are called non-recurring decimal expansions. 5.72772 You can write many examples for this. So that block of digits are not repeating. So the decimal expansion of irrational numbers is non-terminating and non-recurring.